fun. It's Mickey from Awesome Crafty Gamer, and today we are playing Stardew Valley. I'm going to have a bunch of videos this week because my family and I are going are going on vacation. We're going to Kalahari and Hershey Park, so I won't be able to update. So let's just get started. Uh, let's make a girl. She's gonna be tan. Like, oh, yeah, unless I want a beard. So, you just basically pick what you want. How you want to design your character. That's good. I want a cat. Eye color. Blue. Not that blue. And I want, like, a dark hair. Also light. That's good. Um, Mickey, of course. I'm not making it how I look like, I'm actually making it of what I would like to look like. Because <laughs> blue is my favorite color. And my sister's always telling me that um, brown hair, blue eyes is the most absurd thing ever because it's unnatural. But uh, I'm always like, I've always wanted that because <laughs> it's like my favorite thing. Anyway, enough chit chat. She looks great. My name is Quiet Valley Farm, and my favorite thing is animals. I guess I'll have a cat. I'm, I don't want to keep the intro. What's this? Oh, you get to pick up farm. Let's see. Bunch of fish. Nah. Uh, I think the mine is close to her house anyway. I'm going to do this one. Because I can get like bats and stuff, that's cool. Pants color. I think we're good. Don't click back. <laughs> I've done that so many times. Ooh. It's like Santa Claus. And for my very special granddaughter. I'm gonna make a voice. I want you to have the sealed envelope. What's in the envelope? Oh, I took it. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience, my child. Now listen close. His hand is twitching. They, there will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. Oh no. And your bright spirit will fade before growing emptiness. I like this music. Is he gonna die? When this happens, my dear, he'll be ready for this gift. Oh no, Grandpa, don't die! Now let Grandpa rest. 20 years later? How old was I? Get five, maybe, maybe ten. We're like hamsters. Your hamster real energy. Terminated. Is that Woody? What? Woody's in Stardew Valley? I guess there's like a bunch of people. Is that me sleeping on the job? Get your butt up. I almost said something else. Are you good? Oh. What do I do? Oh, the envelope. If you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me. Long ago, I'd lost sight of what mattered most in my life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to this place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy. Quiet Valley Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. 
I know you'll honor the family name, my dear, good luck. My dear, good luck, but Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? So are you implying that he's dead? Let's see. I couldn't see the X, so I was like, where is it? Song. Oh, I was just singing it the other day. Um, riding down the street, something I don't forget. Magic school bus. I'll have to look it up later. Darn it, I forgot the name. Show me the name, show me the name. Baby, what's the name? Ooh, bus stop. Oh, you must be Mickey. Hey, Robin. I'm Robin, a local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here if you'll, ev if you'll follow me. Okay, sounds like I have a choice. Oh, what the heck is wrong with my farm? What? This is Quiet Valley Farm. Thanks. I said that in a depressing voice. Yeah, my point exactly! What is wrong with this? What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overdrawn, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Really, because I want to cover up these holes? Make it look new? And here we are, your new home. Oh, is that Lewis? That's creepy, he was in my house. Ah, the new farm. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. That's great to know. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage, eh? <laughs> it's a good house, very rustic. Is that a good thing? I'm hoping. Rustic? That's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. <laughs> rude! Why you gotta be so rude? Don't listen to her, Mickey. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied to, to that, so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Oh! You just got exposed. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Yeah. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that, you know. Why do I care about the townspeople? Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. So, what? You're like a raccoon in garbage cans. Well, good luck. It's a little creepy, though, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, I got a chicken? Or a rooster. Sorry, rooster. Maybe I do. Your progress has been saved. Okay, I know how to move. Run, shift. Oh, okay. Check. Thanks. Wait, what? Oh. I thought I squat. <laughs> parsley seeds. You received 15 parsley. Here's a little something to get you started. There, Lewis. Hold on. How do I mute the sound? I just want to mute it down a little bit. Because I <laughs> it's hard to hear me talk. So, let's look around this place. Uh, you got a TV? With report. Welcome to KOZU5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now, the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. I can be a news reporter. Fortune teller. Ooh, I see a glimmer within my scrying orb. 
a shard of knowledge from the future. The spirits are very happy today. They will do their best to shower everyone with good fortune. Oh, I did the wilderness. Am I gonna die tonight? <sighs> did I do this? Welcome to Live It Off the Land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. This one's for all you greenhounds out, greenhorns out there. Chop wood, search for wild horse, earn some cash while waiting for your first harvest. Thanks for the tip. So, let's see. I got a scythe. What's this? Introductions. Two out of 28 people. It would be a nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet you. Getting started. If you want to become a farmer, you guys can make this if you'd like. Cultivate and harvest a part. Parsnip. So I have to grow a parsnip. Come on. Don't be that. Wait. This is gonna take a while. Um, I'm actually going to. I'm not gonna make it look like the perfect house. Because I just need a little bit. So I'm just gonna, like, cult cultivate these crops first. And then tomorrow I'll start working on everything. Because, as you see here, you have like an energy bar, and I don't want to use too much of that, because I heard if you do, you pass out, or like at 2 o'clock in the morning you pass out, something like that. I've only played a little bit of this game before. Um, my friend Jay played it before, but he didn't record it, so I was like, oh, that'd be great for me to record. how it goes behind that. That's cool. He said that... Hold on. Let's just do a little... Oh, we got seeds. seeds. I'm going to chop down this tree. That's all I need for today. Chopping down the tree. Okay, so I got some wood. We're just going to use the hoe. How many seeds do I have? 16? Wait. I don't like doing that. Wait, yeah, I do. <laughs> that was the waste. I gotta make nine. What the heck? Wait, oh my gosh. Is there like a setting? I'm gonna check. Always show, yeah. Let me do that. There we go. Always show. Okay, that's much better. Okay. Now use this. There. So let's plant mm -hmm. these. There. And you have to water it. I really need a sprinkler though, that would make, that would take less time, and I really need to take less time, if that makes sense. So, yeah, let's see. I got clear. That's cool. Oh, I didn't actually need that much. Uh, maybe I'll go into town today and buy some, a few more, so I can get 18 seeds. Um, well, 18. I usually like it to be an even number, so like, or like even spots. If that makes sense. Um. So I'm gonna chop down a few more trees um, so I can get more wood there. Um, let's head down to town well I guess we can explore a little uh, I'm gonna do most of that stuff off camera because it's gonna take too long and I don't think I should at that. Ooh, what's this? Fire. Mm -hmm. A dandelion. Oh, 
goodie. Can I give that to someone? Maybe a gift. Oh, there's another one. So, I'm just gonna get a few greetings done today, I guess. I'm sorry if this video was really boring. Oh, there's a person. I just started this game. What? Who are you? It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. So I guess if you give them something, you can make friends with them. I perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents of Pelican Town. It's rewarding work. I hope you'll find your own work equally rewarding in time. You want a dandelion, bro? Huh. That's such a nice gift. Thank you. You're welcome. So, what's social? He's single. I don't know if I want to date you. Let's check these houses. Ooh, there's a guard key. Okay. Oh, I don't want trash. What's this? Oh, it's the garbage can? Maybe that puts that in the garbage can. Can I go in your house? Who are you? Stranger, my name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Thanks, this is your mom. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined. That's okay. I'm Jody. It's a quiet little town, so it's very exciting when someone new lives here. Having a farmer around could really change things. Oh, you look like a pretty lady. I'm gonna give you this. Blech, I hate this. What? I'm never giving you a present again. So these are bedrooms? What? Who went outside? Oh. You just left your son alone? What kind of a mother are you? Hey, stop that! How'd you see me? Oh, you look nice. Ooh, I can read it on your face! You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. What saloon? Is that like a bar? There's a saloon. Let's check it out. It's locked. Oh, so you need a key. Yes. A graveyard. I'm, I'm not gonna check those. That's creepy. Well, I have to... I'm gonna keep you. Let me check the shops, because I think they close early. <laughs> Let's see. What's this? Blacksmith? Can I see the anvil? Uh, upgrade. Oh, you need money. Duh, you need money for everything. Can I get out? Oh. I guess it's just the same thing. Hold on, let me see if I can talk to you. Er, uh, hi, I'm Clint. I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. Thanks, Clint. Well, maybe now it's time to get stuck in my fix today. Let me look. Does that mean I got nothing, or? Welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeologist Office. Uh, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off of the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for this today. What? Why don't you have a hard thing? But I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find out any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Maybe he's not real. He's just in, like, maybe you can't, like, make friends with him. That's sad. Um, let me go to the beach. Hold on. There's a map. Oh, who are you? Ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting, and whose arrival has sparked many a congress. Congress. Wait, I gotta give him a, like a, a sweet voice. Ah, the new farmer. 
We've all been expecting. The news arrival have we sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. You look great. I might as well. Uh. We'll date him. He seems great. I can't think about that yet. I just started my phone. Oh, who are you? I think I met you. Yeah. So how was your first night in the old cottage? I didn't actually sleep there. Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that house. Ah, stop the gossip. My grandpa's dead. I think. I don't even know if my own grandpa's dead. I'll be back tomorrow. Are you kidding me? No, you can't do that. No. Eight out of twenty-eight. I have so much more to go. Bar. Wait, this is house. Wait, I saw something. <laughs> Who are you? Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think we're gonna get along. Get along great. I'm Alex. I'll see you around. Was that like a uh, pickup line? Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I forward to meeting you. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really after... Wait. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dy dynamic. It's exciting. Hi. Oh, did you want something? I made her sound so like such a kid. Wait. Wait. Hello. It's nice to meet you. Time to move here. The spring is lovely. Wait, why are you going through the back? Are you like a robber? Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Good to meet you too, Sam. Well, nice to meet you too. Let me see if the shop's open. I think it closed. I'm not sure. What? Someone's birthday's the seventh. Wait, isn't that the mayor? Darn it, I'll just, it's not open. Hey, it's Miss Mickey, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from your, you from a good press. A little agriculture could really inject new life into the local economy. Thanks. Is there anyone else? Oh, there's a girl. Is this your daughter? Hello, you must be Mickey, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. My husband runs the general store here. Oh, that's his wife. And have you met my daughter Abigail? She's the pale one with the purple hair. No, I haven't met her. What's this? Oh, you're fancy. Man, I want this. I've never seen that before. Like in any of the houses, why don't I have one? I'm not good enough. Anyway, where's your daughter? Oh, I can't. Oh, she's. I think she's in there. But I can't tell. I can't. I don't think I can. Can I go in there? Come on. I'm in. You're not good enough friends with Abigail to enter her bedroom. Oh, that's great. Let's see what to do. Um. This is a house. Alex. Oh, it's an old couple. Well, elder. I don't want to be like that. Why, hello and welcome to our little community here. You can call me Granny if you like. I guess this is your husband. <laughs> it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. <laughs> no, I'm just gonna stand in front of your television. If you stand and watch... Oh! You see that? He was gonna hit me with his wheelchair. So they said to go to the bar. I guess we'll go. Did I meet everyone? I think I would tell me. 
17 out of 28. Great. I still have 11 more people to read. Oh, I already met you. Oh no, it's getting night! Who are you? Hey kid, the name is Pam. Hey, kid, I buy you a drink if I could afford it. Ha! Oh, she said the same thing. Well, hello there. I'm Gush, chief chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. Hi there, Mickey. I'm glad to see you. You're always welcome here. Okay, I guess they said the same thing. I already met you. Can I buy something? Ooh, I can! Cheese cauliflower. It smells great. Oh, you can get recipes? Um, thanks, but I'm just gonna buy bread. I'll, be, I'll buy a beer next time. I'll buy someone a drink. I don't want to... I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? Jeez. Won't be talking to you anytime soon. Social. Let me see who's single and who's not. Harvey is single. Shane is single. Penny is single. George, Evelyn. Alex is single. Vincent. Why can't I marry Vincent? He's just a kid. Or maybe I'm a kid. You never know, Stardew Valley. Sam is single. Louis, Pierre, Caroline, Gus, Emily, Pam, Clay. Elliot's single. Mario single. Leah's single. Jody's. Jody's. Abigail. Yeah, she said her name was Abigail. I think that's Abigail. I didn't meet her yet. Robin. I think they're in the same house. Pretty sure. Uh. I'm just gonna, uh, that's the homeless guy, the wizard, don't know, oh, that's the fishing guy, I don't know who they are, I think she's the animal lover, can I play a game? Journey of the Prairie King, oh, this is cool, how do I play, what do I do? I'm just gonna keep dying. Can I exit the game? Yeah, just kill me. I wanna get out of this game. Kill me. Thank you. That was cool. I'll let you guys figure this out on your own. This game is... Oh, I don't think I mentioned it. This game is on Steam for $15. It might have been up more than since I've been on Steam. But, yeah. I think that's it for the day. I'll check up here. I don't think I checked here. Maybe there's more things to get. There's a fountain. Uh, there's an abandoned house. It's locked. Great. <sighs> One is nothing is locked. Let me check. Here. Or something. Can I go in your house? Wait. 8 a.m. 8 p.m. Wait, who are you? Oh, I can meet you. Oh, you just moved in, right? Cool. Out of all the places you could live, you chose Pelican Town? Great to know. I guess I chose the wrong again. Everyone's like, really? Quiet Valley Farm? Pelican Town? You had me there? Couldn't you have Like... What? Oh well. So, time to go home. Zip city do da <laughs> Hey you. 
stranger. Hello. Don't mind me, I just live out here alone. Okay, bye. I won't mind you. I feel terrible. I think I should start getting home. Is this home? Wait. I see you. Inventory full? I'll eat the... Uh, I don't need clay, do I? Hope not. Actually. Yeah, I don't need clay. I hope not. It's a horse reddish. Horse reddish. Let me get home. Ooh, bleak. Ah, uh, darn it. I can always get you. Um. Darn it. I didn't clean up. There. Can I get through? Just want to live. Is that a slime? No, I don't have time for slimes. This is what happens when you pick that one, ladies and gentlemen. Don't, I don't have time for this. That looks cool, though. Man. Um. I'm gonna put you in there. I don't think I need you. If I do, too bad. Um. Yes. Oh, I can't see it. Farming, zero. Foraging, zero. Fishing, mining, other. Total, $24. Day one of spring, year one. Well, thank you for everyone who watched this video. I'm going to end it here. Uh, thanks again, and I love you all, and be sure to subscribe. Uh, comment down below what you thought of the video, and don't forget to like. Thank you, and bye!